Supermodel Tatiana Petit has died. She was 56 years old. It's all the perspective, you know, it's from the artist. News of Tatiana's death was first announced by Vogue, who helped launch the iconic fashion model's career. The cause of death has not yet been released. I'm a model. I've worked in the fashion business for a long time. I was born in Hamburg, Germany, and I grew up in Sweden. Tatiana rose to fame in the late 80s and 90s, eventually considered one of the original supermodels. Each person sees a woman or portrays a woman and... Differently. Yeah, differently, and it's, it's just a beautiful, beautiful portraits. That's what I like to say more than shots. You know, just beautiful portraits. No stranger to the camera, she made herself a home in the pages of magazines like British Vogue, Marie Claire, and Cosmopolitan, even appearing on the cover of Vogue six times. That's where the relationship comes in, like how long have you known a photographer? Certain photographers make you feel comfortable, where you don't feel, you know, like it's a big deal. Fans may also remember Tatiana from her appearance in George Michael's hit music video, Freedom 90. Alongside her, Tatiana's fellow OG models, Christy Turlington, Linda Evangelista, Naomi Campbell, and Cindy Crawford. Despite her growing fame, Tatiana seemed to never get comfortable with all the attention that came with it. No, it's not something I'm used to, and I, uh, I don't know what to think of it, actually. While in her later years, Tatiana lived a private life, mostly out of the spotlight, she'll be remembered for her iconic work and legacy in the fashion world. I think style is ageless because it's about identity and self-expression. 